الله وبركاته بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل هو الله احد الله الصمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا احد صدق الله العلي العظيم صلوات بر محمد وعلي first of all we'd like to thank allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for giving us tawfiq to be here in these 10 days to remember uh, imam hussain ashab al hussain and the aulad and all the qurbani of imam hussain may allah give us tawfiq to not just remember the qurbani but remember the message of imam hussain inshallah and bring it into our lives ameen ya rabbi la And uh, now what we want to ask, inshallah, just a few announcements. First of all, I want to introduce our center. A lot of people here uh, have been coming to the majlises. Uh, I think I've asked, uh, some people have asked that they don't even know where the MC center is. Our center, alhamdulillah, is based near Newbury Park on the Eastern Avenue. It's 874-878 Eastern Avenue, Newbury Park. And inshallah, tomorrow, as the brother announced, we will be having the Amal Yom Ashura and the Majlis of the Maktal. All the program will be in the daytime over there tomorrow. So please, uh, if you don't have the address, you can always take it off me or one of the brothers from here. So we'll, inshallah, we'll see you there tomorrow. That's on the corner of uh, Glebelands Avenue. Just to let you know that the parking there is only restricted between 11 and 12 on the single lines. Otherwise, you can always park anytime except that time uh, on the single lines. And there's lots of parking around there. But please, one thing we will say, please remember our clock that we park considerately. We do not block anybody's drive. And uh, please, please, uh, uh, as I said, please don't offend anybody. We don't want any uh, trouble with our neighbors. We need to be nice and remember our clock when parking. <coughs> uh, also, just to let you know about our other programs, uh, we have. Alhamdulillah, Shabai Juma program at our center. We have all the Vilada and Shahada programs. And uh, we have a texting service. We text everybody. Also, we put some of the programs on our Facebook page as well. But if you, if you are not getting any messages, please kindly leave your details at the desk over there so we can always text you and you can receive the programs. Just with that, uh, just, remind, just remember something that I would like to mention. That uh, a few years ago, we went to South America and a lot of Shia brothers from Lebanon had moved over there. They got very busy in their work and their dunya and their business. They didn't make a markas. They, were, they weren't in touch with it because they didn't have a markas. They didn't have a center. They weren't in touch with it. And with my own eyes, I saw people. We, we got to know people who had actually, their names were Hassan and Hussain. And a few, few years later, 10, 15 years later, their names were Hassan and Hussain, but they had become Christians. So it's very, very important that not just to commemorate Imam Hussain these days, it's very important that you and your children remain steadfast as a community together and that is done through having our own center. Alhamdulillah, we have our own center, so you should be visiting that on a regular basis. If nothing, at least on the Shabai Juma programs, and we have Juma, we have Juma, and I just mentioned the address to you, which is uh, on the, in the Frankfurt Club, on the drive, Ilford, IG1, 3PS. It's uh, a recreational center next to a school, as I said, and uh, you can always Google the address. As I said, it's IG1, 3PS. So please, kindly, so many brothers and sisters here, mashallah, the brothers, they should all attend the Juma program as and when they can, please. And also, Shabai Juma program and the Shahadas and the Viladas. Please make sure that you keep in touch with your center. It's your center. It's for everybody, so we should get mustafid from that and benefit from that. We all we have a madrasa, inshallah, there three days a week during the week. We have a Saturday madrasa and we have a Sunday madrasa. So please kindly keep in touch with your center and your children. They need that Islamic education to be strong, inshallah, in life and become good followers of the Alabath in the future by having that education. As much as we spend time on our uh, the other education for our children, we take them tuition, we do all the other things, we must also give them a good Islamic education because we will be questioned about that. So please kindly keep in touch with the center. Uh, would like to first start uh, just to thank a few people who have been involved. First of all, obviously, Alhamdulillah, all the public, without you, this is not all possible. Jazakallah khair for attending the majlis, may Allah give you ajr for that donating towards the programs. Uh, we, we still need everybody to help. 
Uh, we did announce the membership program. Still, we have membership forms over there. Anybody who is not a member in the brothers and sisters, please, kind, please kindly take the membership forms and fill them in and become members. In that way, you can deno donate Sadka Jariya and also be involved with the center and we have your name, address and contact details so we can keep in touch with all the, all the community in Ilford, inshallah. Uh, after that, I'd like to thank the Maulanas for mashallah, mashallah, may Allah bless them and give them more tofiq uh, for their efforts. They have done such good, good tabligh and delivered the message of Muhammad Wali Muhammad uh, so eloquently. Please, can we have a loud salawat for them? Then I would like to also thank all the volunteers who have done such a good job in the ladies and the gents and the teachers who have run the parallel majalis and the classes. Jazakallah khair to them. May Allah bless them and allow sarwat for them as well. Whilst I'm finishing off here, brothers are collecting for our Muharram programs. Please kindly donate generously for that. Jazakallah khair. Another, another request I'd like to make is, mashallah, we have a lot of youth here, a lot of people's, uh, mashallah, skilled people here. We want you to please, uh, again, the main thing is being in touch with the center. If you don't if be in touch with the center, we can't actually use people's skills. So please, kindly, if you are willing to volunteer for whatever work you can do, we'd be very grateful that, uh, for that. So if you get involved, we have your details, what you do, what you're good at, what you can contribute towards the center. It's your community, what you can come contribute to the community, please leave your details and we'll get in touch with you. At the moment, uh, sisters are running a madrasa in the weekdays, they need help with teachers. Uh, Sunday madrasa need help with teachers and also volunteers uh, to help in the programs as well. So please kindly come forward for that. Uh, another thing I would like to mention uh, is uh, Part of the MCE, mashallah, we have a charity called the Hasna Trust. Uh, we have, uh, alhamdulillah, been raising funds for our brothers and sisters wherever they need it. We've been sending uh, funds to Pakistan. Uh, every Eid, we send funds to the, those who are mustahikin, who need the help. Uh, alhamdulillah, we've collected over 6,000 pounds for uh, the Syrian refugees who are suffering so much in uh, Greece. Alhamdulillah, some brothers of the community went with us. Uh, we've been there twice, inshallah, we'll, uh, some, of us, one, uh, some of us are going again on the 22nd of October. So if anybody would like to donate towards that, please kindly see myself later on, and inshallah we'll do that. Uh, also, we are, uh, we've been, been having fundraising for our brothers and sisters. About 200 families became homeless when there was an earthquake a few weeks ago in Bakuba in Tanzania. And uh, inshallah, we've raised some of our funds, but we want to inshallah increase that, and we'll be sending that money through our sister, through our uh, brothers and sisters in uh, Stanmore in the uh, World Federation, inshallah, through them we'll be sending that. If anybody would like to donate that to, towards that, they're welcome to do that. But as I said, the main thing is not just being Shias in our comfort zone here. It's beautiful to be able to live for other brothers and sisters who are less fortunate than ourselves. So please kindly keep that in mind. And always, always, wherever you can, it doesn't have to be through ourselves. But please do help your Muslim brothers and sisters everywhere. They need your help. And this is Husayniyat, to stand for the Muslims everywhere. Also, uh, brothers, uh, mashallah, brother uh, Mehtab and brother Hussain Zaidi put a, uh, yesterday they put together a presentation about our center. And as they mentioned there, inshallah, we have plans to extend the center. Uh, to make more space for our uh, program, inshallah, it would be beautiful one day when we can have our own Muharram there, our own Friday prayers there, inshallah. And again, it has to be through the community. We have to help one another to achieve that. So if anybody can help in any way with that, inshallah, please kindly let us know. Uh, there's brothers uh, who are, I know there's brothers here who are, mashallah, running building companies, inshallah, we'll, move, we'll be requesting them to come and give us advice about that. And last but not least, I'd like to thank the directors, all the members of the MC committee, mashallah. Uh, I, I really appreciate everybody who's been helping so well and alhamdulillah for doing all these programs and may Allah, please pray for us, may Allah give us tawfiq, unity, to inshallah carry on serving the community in a good manner. For all of them, please, allow salawat. <laughs> Brothers, many
mentioned uh, uh, Brother Zakir Sajib Sam passed away, but for all our Marumeen, can we all please uh, read Surah Fatiha together, please? Now I'd like to invite uh, Aga Muhammad Munib to. Sorry, Salam alaikum. Thank you. Uh, and of course, if you can give a loud salawat not just to the president of MCE, but especially all of the volunteers behind the scenes, who many of you probably haven't even recognised, but they're the ones who are making this possible. Loud salawat ala Muhammad wa ali Muhammad. Very quickly before we ask the chef to come and deliver tonight's lecture, first and foremost we need uh, all of you brothers inshallah to kindly come as far forward as possible because we have a lot of latecomers and so that they don't disturb our respected speaker when he does. If you can move forward now and then they can take your place at the back. So thank you very much. Keep coming forward as much as you can. There's a lot